if we defend the gospel with our minds but betray the gospel with our lives, the greatest intellectual defense of the gospel will fall to the ground. But we should not only defend the gospel with our minds, we must live the gospel with our lives. I don't know how many of you watched C-SPAN broadcast of the Congressional Gold Medal Award given to Dr. Billy Graham this last week. Unfortunately, the mainline media didn't play it, but C-SPAN did in entirety. But I was challenged to tears. I was challenged to tears by it. A man who is now looking back on nearly 60 years of ministry, he has never deviated from the proclamation of the gospel or from faithfulness to his Lord. Dr. Graham was once asked, how is it that while others have been uh, ridden with scandal, you have been able to live above this during your entire ministry? He replied, Every morning I get up and the first thing I do is fall on my face before God and say, God, rather than let me bring reproach on your name today, take my life. I commend to you that with that attitude, you will never fall asleep at the wheel and defending the gospel intellectually because the defender is not falling asleep spiritually.